Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode I'm going to not make a review but uh, I, would, I would say idea comparison of uh, Ernesto Ice, Ice Lolly ice cream molds and uh, straight away this is rigid and this is a flexible and I would say why this approach is it's better than that one um, on the beginning first uh, two main differences this is the capacity of a 70 milliliters and you can use the whole capacity out of the this this mold because it's sealed on the top and here the capacity is 60 milliliters and you can use only half of it because uh, the, 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 sealing, the sealing mechanism let's say in this way it's in the in the middle so I think you start to get the point uh, why I have made this uh, comparison um, because with those molds you are first of all you are not able to seal it properly uh, or you can but uh, I would say in different way you are using only half of the, the capacity and um, because here we have this nice how to say uh, plastic bar that is um, that is uh, keeping in, 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 in place in shape uh, this this uh, what is coming out of this mold uh, I think you will keep it in your fridge upside down because if you try to fill it up then put it into a let's say regular position the whole fluid will go down there and you will end up with a let's say ice cream which is half uh, filled up and by the way, you could expect some leaks because, let's say, I think this is uh, slightly bigger than that one. But if not, the, the, the best uh, scenario it will be that the split is even, so uh, you will not have a leakage, but you will not get, uh, you will not end up with ice cream. So first of all, it's not some kind of uh, intuitive, but you need to store it in your fridge upside down. So like this. Second, sorry. Uh, Therefore, I think um, such uh, approach with uh, uh, some kind of uh, sealing mechanism on the top is better. It could be done here as well easily. It, only what you need to have is some kind of, uh, I, not, I don't want to say valve, but uh, inlet that will allow you to fill it up from the bottom to the very end. And that's it. So this is a simple. Uh, by the way, it has a higher um, temperature resistance because from minus 14 uh, degrees Celsius up to uh, 130 or 40 to be uh, to be precise. Sorry, 20, 20. Lack of preparation. Uh, but th this one has a from minus 20 range up to 90. So uh, so smaller range. Uh, to show some uh, disadvantages, uh, most of such flexible, let's say, plastic rubber something, uh, some things has uh, certain plasticizers in it. Uh, so, according to some research, plasticizers are not so uh, human friendly, at least some of them. So, okay, I could imagine that they have all certificates, they are tested, and so on. But just to let you know, and by the way, all plastics are not so healthy better to use uh, uh, if possible glass but if you cannot I would say from for, from healthy point of view rigid plastic is uh, in my opinion or according to my knowledge uh, safer if you have a uh, different data different different opinion definitely to share with me and with the others in the section uh, comment section below so I would say stupid item but some thoughts behind uh, I thought it would be good to to share with you my observation I'm curious about your opinion so thank you for watching stay tuned and see you next time bye